capacity within us to actually rise out of our comfort zone and to actually care, you know, to care about the world and to care about the problems and the challenges around us and then to see how we can respond with everything that is within us uh, to what we see around us. Um. The voice has always been there for me. All my values stem from what I've learned with the voice. I've really grown as a person and I'm excited that with these platforms that I have this year, more people will know about the voice, more people will know that they have a purpose and more people will do greater things for themselves and their country. So. What is the capacity that I have to create change? What is the capacity that young people have to create change? And so I want to leave you with that. That's one of the things that really excites me about The Voice, really excites me about Oak Tree, is that we, as organisations, invest in young people, invest in each other to create powerful change for a world we know is possible. For me, it's a real dream come true that um, a certain time in one's life, you think, well, I'm not going to be here forever. And all the hopes and aspirations I had for the country that I love will be in the hands of those who are now at university, and they too will have to hand on to the next generation. So a time will come in your life when you will be thinking these same issues that I'm thinking about, and that you will prepare the young ones who are in kindergarten now, or in primary school now, the next generation that will then build on what you have built. What the theme generation means to us? Firstly, we have three major values. That's virtue, purpose, responsibility. You need to know who you are, first of all. Your virtues help create who you are going to be and how you can influence the people around you. And the theme generation helps you define a responsibility for yourself and the people within your community. And with pain, that's always the context in which we make this message because things are not right. Uh, another topic uh, we discussed with, uh, we all that awareness on was uh, edu uh, health, another was the uh, environmental conservation and climate change, and how we can sustain or look after our environment. What you're doing is you're the pioneers of building the future. And the future will be that there will be, it is this identity of being Papua New Guinean. vision for my community um, is that in the future uh, there will be a lot of children in the school than, uh, than um, on the street. It's important for us as a Christian country to really push for the, the building of an incitement, a character building. And that's one of the things I like about uh, uh, your program in The Voice Inc. There are a, a lot of problems in this country because of uh, how the culture is. So I have a dream that PNG one day uh, could be united. And my dream for PNG is to see a new new PNG with new people and new mindset. And Papua New Guinea to be a godly nation. To continue to see young Australians and young Papua New Guineans coming together um, to enhance our collective impact. Uh, one thing I believe in my service, I have a potential to influence other people, to make this world a better place. And my place for everyone to realize their purpose, their potential, because without that, you, won't, you can't be a nation builder. We're there to support you in every way and try and help to bring that, you know, help you to rise through and play your roles in society. My dream for PNG is to see young people, not just young people, but everyone be able to creatively express themselves and be artistic and just be able to have that sort of freedom. We spend a lot of money and time making sure we get that done. It is so important. It's important for the country, absolutely, and it's important for the company for our reputation. And what I love about here is we've got a really great 
partnership between you know, the government, the communities, the landowners and ourselves. We want to continue the partnership with The Voice so that um, as much as possible we synergize and we, we make it a coordinated effort and uh, we're not all working uh, uh, separately in an uncoordinated manner. And part of the planning process and all that is about coordination. It's about getting all the development partners together and that's another policy of ours, a development cooperation policy that we have concluded so that uh, the development effort is coordinated and not disjointed and the development partners under fully understand fully where Papua New Guinea is going and what, what its planning process and priorities are all about. The youths of this country need, need to change their value, values of uh, what they value in life and the STAR strategy uh, will help uh, young people look towards a new development strategy that, that, uh, that is more environmentally friendly and responsible.